Oh, it's you. Didn't think I'd be running into you here. <laughs> I guess it's my lucky day. How are your adventures going lately? Did you come here to get a new commission from Catherine or to get paid? And where are you going after this? Bet you've got a really exciting adventure lined up, huh? Who are you again? The name's Bennett. I'm your run-of-the-mill adventurer from Mondstadt. Oh, I'm talking too much, aren't I? I'm sorry. I was just so excited to run into someone I admire so much. And, uh, maybe a little starstruck, too. Wait, <laughs> you admire me? Of course! You're the mysterious traveler, the hero who quelled the storm terror crisis, and the leader of your own adventure team to boot. Bennett, speak up a little bit. The music is overpowering you, man. If I'm being honest, I'm totally jealous of all your achievements. Wait, what? What achievements? Enviosity's adventure team. Yeah, word's been spreading in adventurer circles for a long time now. Your adventure team shows up all over the continent. Ah. It might look like you're just handling a bunch of boring commissions. True. Then, as soon as something big goes down, you're always there. <laughs> yep. What a coincidence, right? Anyway, I just really envy you. You're sort you said of it? like the protagonist of this world or something. <laughs> Aw, that's now I imagine, right? Me, on the other hand, I'm just some unlucky guy. My adventure team even... Uh, never mind. I shouldn't get all down in the dumps in front of someone I admire. I should be open to see what I can learn. You didn't finish. Wait, what happened? Speaking of which, I have a favor to ask. Um, when you go adventuring later, can I come and watch? I wish there was a no option. <laughs> Is that mean? Uh, you just want to stand there and watch? Aren't you going to give me a hand? Um, I'm just gonna say, aren't you gonna give me a hand? Uh, maybe you don't know. I'm a really unlucky person to have around. If you brought me along in an adventure, my bad luck would probably just screw everything up. Aw, oh, come on, Bennett, don't say that. I don't want to get you into any trouble. So, just let me watch from the sidelines. That'd be good enough for me. Aw, oh, no, 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 no. We could just, hey, hey. We could just do something else instead, Bennett. Nah, I can't go on with that. Hmm? Something else? I guess you're right. Even just the chance to talk with you would be great too. Yeah, let's forget about adventuring for now. <laughs> but, uh, what would we do instead? Hey, we can kill Timmy's pigeons, you know? That's a fun activity. Come on, you'd like that, Bennett. Apart from going on adventures, the only other thing I do is take care of my dads in the Adventurer's Guild. So, I really can't think of anything else to do besides adventuring. Let me think about it. Alright, I feel like whatever we do, as long as you're involved, it'll be totally worth it. Uh, but don't forget, I'll be bringing my bad luck with me. So, it probably won't be a very fun trip. <laughs> Ooh, we got options here. It won't bother me, I'm looking forward to it, as long as you don't cause too much trouble. It won't bother me, Bennett. Hey, hey. Fuck all that, all right? That's good, that's good. I was afraid you'd back out. So, where are we gonna go? I told you. Oh, how about a walk in the wild? How about we hang out around town? A walk in the wild. Let's kill some pigeons. That's a good idea. For someone like me, I'm actually way more familiar with the wilderness than the city. Especially around Mondstadt. I mean, I'm not on the same level as Fischl, who is also in the Adventurer's Guild. But that's expected, because she works in the Intelligence Department. Oh, I know this gorgeous place. It's sort of a dandelion-covered meadow. It's got a great Mondstadt feel. Do you want to check it out? Do I have options? Can't wait. Oh, well, I guess the option is always, yeah, I can accompany you for a quick look. That's such like a soon today kind of option or some shit, right? It's like, ugh, I suppose I'll go and accompany you for just a quick moment, all right? And it's not like I want to or anything. Uh, oh, okay. fuck! I'll try not to let you down. <laughs> My friendship is ruined. Uh, shall we? Huh. 
Is this definitely the right place? It's not what I expected. Uh, I'll say, is this the right place? Uh, what happened? It wasn't like this the last time I saw it. The dandelions are all stripped bare of seeds. Uh, that definitely wasn't me trying to farm for my gene, that's for sure. Was there a windstorm? Or did some strange creature come by? I'm so sorry, bringing you all this way for only you to end up saying nothing. Aww. You couldn't have predicted predicted this. No need to apologize. It's fine. We still got to go out for a nice walk. Maybe scout the place out. Whoa! Rude. Um. Ah, look. No, look. No need to apologize, man. Come on. Look. Hey. Well, that's true. But then again, the unpredictable is to be expected when my luck's involved. Well, there's not much reason to stay here anymore. But how about we take a walk around the area? Maybe we'll find something interesting. All right, quick detour. Just walk around. Where's my loot? No, they've stolen it all. My dandelion seeds. No. It was the hilly churls. Oh, snap. <gasps> what the fuck is this? Wait a minute. Wait. Hold on, let me grab the loot first. One Mora? Wait, did I just get jabated? Cabbage? Hey, do you see that? There's a monster camp up ahead. I can see a whole load of treasure chests with no monsters guarding them. Oh no. It feels a bit off. I was hoping I'd get a chance to flex my muscles a bit. Where did all the monsters go? This is weird. Ah, oh, you scared them off. For me, this kind of good fortune is super rare. It must be because you're here. <laughs> okay, buttering me up. Let's go check it out. Ooh, I wonder what goodies are hidden in those chests. I, I wonder what they respawned. Wait a minute, so I could have gotten the loot ahead of time and then and then let them respawn to get them again. Easy farming. Easy farm for my one radish and my one cabbage. <laughs> Chests actually respawn, Pog. <sighs> we didn't miss any, right? No wonder there are no monsters guarding them. True. What's the problem? We got so much stuff today. We should be happy. How come you look so down? So much stuff? What can you buy with one Mora? Wait, does that mean you usually? Oh, sh shit. Hmm? Chests are always like this, aren't they? Oh, no. Bennett. A few loose Mora, occasionally a cabbage, maybe a radish or something. Oh no, he doesn't actually know. A bit of more and some ingredients to fill our stomachs? That's good enough for me. The kind of chests you mentioned that have weapons, artifacts, or some other treasures inside? Aren't they super, super rare? I've only seen them in places that are so dangerous you'd have to risk life and limb to get there. It's because you don't have good luck? Uh... I can't... Yeah... Uh, I mean, risking your life to get another chest. I mean, yeah, you're you're right. Yeah. Right. So let's not ask for too much. Yeah. Let's keep walking. Who knows when the monsters might return? Yeah, let's get out of here, dude. Shall we? Oh no. Chat. What he doesn't know, man. He doesn't know. Oh my god. This makes me feel bad for him now. You know. This actually makes me feel so bad. <laughs> One Mora is Pog, apparently. <laughs> and normally, I think 20 Primo Gems is Pog. He's the true F2P player. He gets one Mora, one Radish. He's like, yo, let's fucking go. It's so nice here. The breeze is so comforting. Really lifts my mood. I've been adventuring alone for a long time. It feels so nice to have company. Honestly, 
I miss it a lot. <laughs> oh, uh, not that I'm super lonely or anything. I've got my dads to keep me company when I'm not out adventuring. Yeah, of course. Actually, did I tell you about my dads already? Back in the day, they were all great adventurers. They've got so many cool stories. They were the ones who rescued me from a perilous place when I was just a baby. And together, they raised me. Aww. Now, they're all old and frail. Some of them can't even walk by themselves anymore. So, it's my turn to take care of them. I'd love to take you to meet them sometime. You'd be blown away by some of their stories. Um, sounds like there's a lot I can learn. Isn't that tough on you? Absolutely. I'm gonna go with option number I one. Up most of my adventure expertise from them. Let's go. They're incredible. By the way, you did bring a wind glider with you today, right? The weather is so nice and the wind speed is perfect. Why don't we take the chance to go for a glide? The weather is so nice, Bennett. It just started raining. Oh my god, not the bad luck. The bad luck is it? Oh, the moment he said that, dude. Uh, oh. oh my god, Bennett. Oh, we're getting upset. Your bad luck is getting ridiculous. What happened to the weather? I got it. Damn it, Bennett! Uh, sorry, I didn't see this coming. Not to this. Well, oh, it snap. seems that we'd better give up on that idea. Let's go do something else. Bennett, so there you are. Jack? Hi, Jack. Is something going on? Are you here to see me? Some of the older adventurers in the guild are really hurting from their arthritis again. It could be because of the humidity today. You mean my dad's? That's too bad. They'll need someone to take care of them. Well, you're the one who usually looks after them, right? They're all asking for you. Okay, I'll be right over. Uh, oh, wait. Uh... Is this our is this our goodbye, Bennett? It's okay. It's okay. This is important, man. Yeah. Thanks for understanding. Though I feel pretty bad leaving you here. No, it's, it's all good. It's okay. We better hurry back. They're all waiting for you. <laughs> okay. Okay, sure. Well, I have to go now. Let me treat you to something next time. Oh. Bye. Oh, it sounds so sad. Why? It sounds so sad, dude. Hasty farewell. How come the weather suddenly brightened up the second Bennett left? <laughs> Paimon, you're too much. You're too much. Holy shit. <laughs>